Hello everyone, I am Sunali Kanawde, Assistant Professor of Computer Engineering Department of All India, Sri Shivaji Memorial Society, Institute of Information Technology, Pune. Today our topic is Ethereum. In this topic, first of all, what is Ethereum? Ethereum is a decentralized blockchain pl uh, platform that establishes a peer-to-peer -peer network that securely executes and verifies application code called smart contracts. Smart contract allows participants to transact with each other without a trusted uh, central authority. Transaction records are immutable, verifiable, and securely distributed across the network, giving participants full ownership and visibility into transaction data. Also, transactions are sent from and received by uh, user-created Ethereum accounts. A sender must sign transaction and spend Ether Ethereum native to cryptocurrency. As a cost of processing transactions on the network. Then uh, there are several features of Ethereum. First is the Ether, then next smart contracts, Ethereum virtual machine, then centralized applications and decentralized autonomous organizations. First of all, uh, what is uh, Ether? In that Ether is the uh, Ethereum cryptocurrency. Then smart contract is uh, Ethereum allow the development and deployment of these types of contracts. Ethereum virtual machine. Also Ethereum provide, uh, provides the underlying technology, the architecture uh, and the software that understands smart contracts and allow you to interact with it. The inter uh, decentralized application means the apps uh, is nothing but a decentralized application is called the apps also spelled D A P P uh, app or D app uh, for short. Then Ethereum allows you to create uh, consolidated applications called decentralized application. Decentralized autonomous organization mediates Ethereum allow you to create this for uh, democratic decision making. Then next is the uh, real uh, real time. Uh, application of Ethereum. First is the voting system. Voting system, uh, as we know that voting system are uh, adopting Ethereum. The result of polls uh, are pub uh, publicly available, ensuring a uh, transparent and fair uh, democratic process by eliminating voting uh, malpractices. Then uh, second is the uh, banking system. In that uh, Ethereum is getting adopted widely by uh, widely in banking system because uh, with Ethereum's decentralized system, it is challenging for hackers to gain uh, unauthorized access. It also allows payment uh, on an Ethereum based network. So banks are also using Ethereum as a channel to make uh, remittance and payments. Next is the sh shipping. Uh, de deploying Ethereum is shipping helps with the tracking of cargo and uh, prevents goods from being misplaced or uh, or uh, counterfeited. Ethereum provides the uh, provenance and tracking framework for any asset required in typical uh, supply chain. Then next is the agreement. Agreement uh, in that. With Ethereum's uh, smart contract, agreement can be uh, maintained and executed without any alteration. So uh, in, in an industry uh, that has fragmented participants in subject to dispute and require digital uh, contracts to be present, Ethereum can be used as a technology for deploying smart contracts and uh, digitally uh, recording the agreements and the transaction based on them. So in that uh, Ethereum uh, explain the Ethereum's tutorial video uh, and uh, Ethereum smart contract uh, locally, including installing uh, Ganache and, uh, and Node in a Windows environment. So uh, next is the types of Ethereum network. 
there are two types of uh, ethereum networks first was the externally owned accounts that is eoa it is not the, uh, it is a controlled by private key has no associated with uh, associated code and can send or uh, the transaction then second is the uh, contract accounts a contract account accounts has an associated code that executes when it receives a transaction from an eoa thank you